Orlando Magic.com. You, you guys were able to hold with him for three quarters, and Giannis in, in, in the fourth. What, what did you see from him down the down the stretch? Uh, his ability to get to the rim, uh, and that they, they do such a great job of spacing the floor, and you know, putting you in a in a tough situation where you try. To, if you want to get it out of his hands, he's got four shooters around the perimeter. So you know, you 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 say you're going to live with certain things, but he is so efficient in how he gets to the rim. So again, you know, he that's their world champs for a reason, uh, and we just got to you know continue to, to set our bar high and continue to compete night in and night out like we did tonight. Philip Rossman, Rick, Orlando Magic Daily. Um, talk a little bit about the job that Wendell, Wendell did on Giannis the last two nights. I know Giannis still kind of got his numbers, but it, it felt like Giannis was, was really working hard, and Wendell had a big part in that. Wendell, I, I think Wendell did a, a very good job just understanding like body positioning and it's, it's you know, this, it, Giannis gets, drops that shoulder and he gets to that rim and it's tough, you know, but I think Dell did a great job of staying in front for the most part. You know, I have to go back and look at the film at different situations and different angles, but for the most part, Dell made him battle and work, you know, throughout the game. Coach, Tim, Tim Frazier gets the, the start tonight. What do, what do you see out of him, and, and what have you seen with out of him over the course of his time here so far? Well, I think him just being a veteran and being around different players throughout the league and understanding how to play, uh, you know, trying to settle things down with a, with a group of guys and being able to have a, just another ball handle out there. You know, you understand how good defensively they are, uh, understanding what they were doing in the pick and roll, being up on Franz and his pick and roll. So being able to have a secondary ball handle out there was, was very important for us. Um, getting back to Wendell on the on the offensive end, Wendell with with five assists again seems like he's really picked up his passing and that you you put the ball in his hands a lot in in the high post. What 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 have you seen from him as far as kind of being a leader on that offensive side of the ball, someone who kind of can help organize the team a little bit as well, he, even a center? He's a willing passer. You know that's that's the one thing about it. And all our guys are just willing to make the extra pass in a simple play. And you know teams that come out switching, you know being able to facilitate facilitate through our bigs is very important. So I, I think he does a great job of trying to make the right read and finding guys when they're open. Coach Melissa Thomas with Florida National News. Can I talk about the the rally that you were able to see in the third quarter, especially, you know, from previous games, we heard the guys saying like it was important for them to come out strong in the third. How did how did you feel seeing them come out strong this third quarter? Well, I think they did a good job battling and understand there were certain situations and, you know, isolations that we were we caught ourselves in, obviously going with the honest, you know, being able to get downhill. But for the most part, our guys came out and competed, you know, from from beginning, coming out of the coming out of the gates, out of the locker room, just ready to go and fire around for each other, continue to move the basketball and then defensively just, you know, just trying to sit down and guard. Could you talk a lot about this year being about experiences? Uh, you've had two of these unique kind of back-to-back -back sets against the defending champs, which in a way kind of mirror a playoff series. For, for a young group like this to, to have that kind of experience against the defending champs, just how invaluable is that? Well, you know, you talk about little things in that where we are points of emphasis. You know, we kept saying how big Bobby Portis was in these games and his, his three-point shot making. You know, we limit him, you know, to to 0 for 1 from the three-point line, you know, 0 for 1 from the three-point line, you know, force him inside the three. Uh, Pat Connington got us last game, and we, our ability to get to him and, you know, limit his three-point shots. Again, other guys got going. Wesley Matthews made a couple shots, but from a standpoint of where we were trying to adjust and make those adjustments there, I think we did a, pre we did a pretty good job.